Hi, my name is Tim. In this video, we will continue looking at creating a hyperlink in LibreOffice. The last video looked at connecting to a web page. This video will be a tutorial about connecting to an email address. When established, the link will open the user's default email client, such as Microsoft Outlook, and create a new message with the linked email address in the to field of that message. First, this video will review opening the hyperlink dialog, then it will demonstrate setting up the email hyperlink. There are several different ways to access the hyperlink dialog. First, you need to highlight the text you wish to create a, a hybrid link with, or place the cursor in the document where you want the hyperlink to be. Then, do one of the following. If you're using Windows or a Linux distro, press Ctrl plus K. If you're using a Mac, press the Command key and K. This will open the dialog. Also, in the standard toolbar, there is a hyperlink icon. Clicking that will open the hyperlink. The third way is to click the Insert menu and choose the hyperlink item. When the dialog opens, click on the Mail tab if it is not already the active tab. Next, enter the desired email address or addresses in the recipient field. The arrow on, on the right of, of the, the uh, field gives past email addresses that you have used. Since I don't have any, I will type some. If you are using one more than one email address, separate the email addresses with a comma. There's also a data sources button to the right of the recipient recipient field. Clicking on it will open any databases that, that you have created and you can choose from any tables or queries to, to find any email addresses that that can be used. The next field is a subject field. This will correspond with a subject field in the email message that will be created. So whatever you type in here will show up in the subject line on the subject line of your email message in your e in the email client under further settings um, in the frame you can you can choose one of the following target attributes however this this only really applies to to web pages and in form you you're going to want to choose make sure text is chosen there is a button choice but this only applies if you're creating a form um, in the text field if you the, the words you've highlighted in the document will appear here. You can change them and that will change the, the words in the document or if you just select a location and want to add words. If, you, if you've just selected a location in your document where you want the email link to be and you want to add words instead of, of li listing the email address 
um, type the words there and the name field that only applies to a button when you're done click OK and as you can see you now have an email link now that the link has been established it can be clicked and the document users default email client will launch the, um, the user needs to be sure that the email client is set up with his or her address otherwise it this won't won't work the uh, a, a new message will not be created and these emails will not be inserted in the in the to field so if if the person has not not set up their email client they need to do that before using this link but um, to launch the email client um, if you're using Windows or a Linux distro hold down the control button and then click on this link if you're using a Mac um, hold down the command button and click on this And the uh, new new message with the subject line hello as we entered in the hyperlink dialog and the three email addresses that were included appear in the to field. This video has been about creating an email hyperlink in LibreOffice. Thank you for watching. Click on the subscribe to OS College channel box and check out my other videos on YouTube.